All right. So it's like 1 a.m. in the morning. I wake up and I hear my little brother off in the kitchen. He's talking to one of the people he knows at work. And I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, hmm, what am I doing here? Why am I in this house? Why did I leave Spain? What caused me to want to make these decisions to dramatically alter the road, the path that I had been paving in my life? Was it coronavirus? Was it losing my job? Was it having no money? What was it? Because I had the resources to stay in Spain. I had the resources to create that life that I wanted. And all of a sudden, my mind was so, so, so very stuck in regret. And I feel like this happens to so many people. We're just not willing to admit it to ourselves. That we're unhappy about how we're thinking and how we're acting and how we're feeling in this present moment. I just want to say that you have control over these thoughts, these feelings, and these actions. You have control over the way you feel. And at the end of the day, because I woke up again, went back to sleep. It's not like I got up when I was feeling this way. It's not like I got up and started doing something about it. I just went back to sleep because that's the normal reset button. It always makes the feelings go away. But when I woke up again, guess what? No negative feelings. No feeling is regret. Everything was wish washed away. But you know what I lost in the trade for it? I lost a lot of time that could have been productive. Time where I would have entered the operating system and reprogrammed some of those thoughts that would have led me to some of those actions. Because, look, we all want to make something better of our life. At least I would hope we would all want to make something better of our life. It'd be pretty crap if we're trying to like go out there and like make something worse of our lives, right? Hey, Loki, that's me. I swear. Has to be me. But there is a hope. There is a path to finding out what experiences you want to create, what memories you want to have, what legacy you want to leave. I have a like I have many legacies, believe me, they're not all great. Dude, in fact, I think I'm more infamous than famous at this point in time. Not even kidding. A lot of people know who I am, but like not for good reasons. But yo, I'm just saying, you got to take control of the way we feel right now. And in order to take control of the way we feel right now, we got to decide what we want to do with our time. And when we're talking about working, when we're talking about living, when we're talking about creating, it's not about doing that stuff. It's about figuring out what you want to do, man. And do you really want to be like, oh, I want to be, I want to be like one of these big media influencers. I mean, if you want it, do it, go after it. I, I, I watch these videos, man, and they're entertaining. But, like, I look at myself and I'm like, dude, man, I could never, ever, ever make content like that. I can never do it. It just doesn't make sense. It doesn't compute in my brain. So I'm like, yo, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Who am I going to be? Where am I going to go? And I'm sitting here and I'm thinking, I don't even want to stream anymore, man. It's so late in the day, man. What's the point of even trying, man? There's, there's nothing that I could do. It's ever, ever, ever gonna like get me to that big influential point where all these great things are happening in my life. Whoa. What am I saying? I've already had all these great things happening in my life and I've like made decisions. Decisions that have really not made it as great as it could have been. But I mean, you know, it's not just me, not just you. We all making mistakes man we all making mistakes and mistakes are okay because mistakes are you and me kind of thing we're in this together it's a human experience a series of individualized experiences headed in one direction in order to make you a better person but don't you don't gotta wait <laughs> until like legit you're 30 you're 30 years old i'm feeling 25 right now man yeah i'm feeling 25 right now man and i can say this that it ain't easy feeling 25 and I've started from the bottom. Now we here. No, we ain't, we ain't here and we ain't getting there anytime soon, man. I've started a path. I've started building a path, a path that I like. And then like, I have no idea what I'm doing, man. But anyway, yo, I'm going to end it right there. Thank y'all for listening to this quick little rant about feelings in the morning. I'm going to keep doing this stuff. Real talk. Get ganky.